This video shows an overview and a demo of Mass Ingestion Databases, a feature of Cloud Mass Ingestion in Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services. With Cloud Mass Ingestion, you can quickly and accurately ingest large amounts of data from a variety of sources into cloud data warehouses, data lakes, and messaging hubs. You can ingest data in batches or in real time for analytics and visualization. You can ingest data in real time from database, streaming, and local file sources. Then you can monitor the jobs on a comprehensive dashboard. With mass ingestion databases, you ingest data from your database or data warehouse sources, load data warehouse, data lake, or messaging system targets such as Snowflake, Azure Synapse Analytics, Amazon S3, Microsoft ADLS Gen 2, or Kafka and then capture the change data and apply it to targets in real time. Let's walk through an example. Meet Abel, a data analyst for a financial services company. Abel's company wants to perform advanced analytics and machine learning on data that's stored in an on-premises database. To do this, they'll need to migrate their Oracle database to a Snowflake cloud data warehouse. First, they'll load the data from Oracle to Snowflake, and then they'll use change data capture, or CDC, to keep the Oracle and Snowflake data synchronized. In Cloud Mass Ingestion, Abel creates database ingestion tasks that ingest and synchronize the data. Then, he can monitor the ingestion jobs in real time on a comprehensive dashboard. Let's see how he does it. In this video, we'll create a database ingestion task that loads data from an Oracle source to a Snowflake target, and then keeps the Oracle and Snowflake data in sync with change data capture. In Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services, Go to the Mass Ingestion Service and click New. Click Database Ingestion Task. The Database Ingestion Task Wizard starts to guide you through creating your task. Here you enter a name for the task. Let's include the source and target types and the load type so we can easily find the task again. You can select a project folder where you want to store the task or you can use the default location. Next, select the runtime environment that contains the secure agent that you want to use to run the job. Select a load type for the task. We'll use the initial and incremental loads type to run an initial load, followed by incremental loads to capture the changed data. Click Next. On the source page, we'll choose a connection to the source database. Select an Oracle source connection. Now select the schema of the source tables from the list. You can define rules for refining table selections. The default rule selects all tables in the schema. You can also generate a CDC script to enable supplemental logging on key columns or all columns in the selected source tables. Under Advanced, you can set the Restart Point option to change the start point in the logs for the first run of the job if you don't want to use the default. Click Next. Here we'll configure the target. We select a Snowflake connection, and now we select the schema for the target tables that the database ingestion job will generate. Then enter the name of the internal staging area that holds the source data before it's written to the target. You can also add rules for renaming the target tables here so they'll be different from the source table names. For example, you can add a prefix. Click Next to go to the Runtime Options page. Here, you can change the number of rows that a database ingestion job can write to an output file. You can also customize the schema drift options to control how database ingestion jobs will react to changes on the source. Click Save. Now you can deploy the task on a secure agent. First, make sure that the secure agent is running. Also, if you have any target tables that don't match the structure of the source tables, drop them. The task will regenerate the tables and click Deploy. The task deployed successfully, so it's now a database ingestion job. Let's check the job. Click My Jobs, and here we see the job we created. When you're ready to run the job, select Run from the Actions menu. Click the job name to view more details, like how long the job's been running, if there are any alerts for the job, and the job's overall performance. In this video, we learned about mass ingestion databases in Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services. We learned how to create a database ingestion task, deploy the task, and monitor the status of the ingestion job. 
Click the link in the description to register for a free trial of Cloud Mass Ingestion.